Uh, this is the last of everything I got today for my $400. Uh, that stuff, plus some, is already in the garage. Uh, for $14, I guess, $8.50, $6.50, that's $15. I got two mats, uh, Jonasons, full lead uh, suite in there, sign in the bottom. Matt Jonasons is a um, glass artist that you can put on eBay and they do buy your stuff. This is probably the more valuable piece because of the size. Um, this is probably 45, 35, something like the 20, 20 to, to 75 and stuff for it goes for it, depending on the piece. Um, got another Fenton Bear. I'm going to lot this with the other one that I have. Um, let me do the jewelry quick. Got an assortment of jewelry. Nothing too amazing. Paid five for this. My wife likes this stuff. This is multi strand uh, with the dangle stuff. She paid five. She'll probably sell for eight. This is just a multi strand. Uh, nobody. Here's some uh, earrings in there. We paid three. Evidently, they're silver with, uh, so looks like silver. Here's a uh, enamel sterling pin. Uh, it's Denmark. I can't really read it right now. I'm in too much of a rush. This should be 35 to 75 easily. Um, and I don't think, well, I think we paid 20 for a group of jewelry, 25. Uh, Indian pin, uh, ring. This should be like a $20 ring, but I don't know. They're hard to sell. Um, an old silver cameo ring. Probably, we'll probably get like 15, 20. We don't know what this is made of. We're assuming it's made out of brass, uh, but we're hoping it's made out of uh, uh, something else. Uh, whatever. Uh, Indian pin. Like a Navajo design. I don't know if it's sterling. Um, we'll probably get like uh, 10 uh, 20 for that. Um, this says 925, but it's weird. we got to clean it up, see what happens. could just be uh, someone's getting it. It's like a Mexico 925. It says 925 run on it. All right, here it is. Uh, Mexico. It's like tax go. It says 925, whatever. Um, that if, this, if we clean this up, we'll probably get like 50 for that. Um, if I put it on eBay, I'd get like maybe 75 to 125. Um... Let's see. This is just uh, sodalite, it looks like, and sterling. We'll probably get like 20. Uh, this is gold, turquoise and gold. I don't know what we're going to get for this, you know. I don't know if I should scratch. It might be damaged. Uh, it may not be repairable. See the end over here? So I, right there, I'm not going to solder it back. So we might just peel off all the gold, get what we get for it. And uh, then these are our uh, abalone shell earrings. Not a bad haul, and we did get gold today, and I know we didn't pay that much for the jewelry. I kind of went through what we paid. I, we paid 25 for uh, this lot here. I think we paid, yeah, this was part of it. Yeah, I think we paid like 25 for all of that there, and then this stuff. So we probably paid about $40 a jewelry. Um, let's see, art glass bowl, um, carnival glass, I paid a dollar. Two, uh, what do you call these? Uh, Mm. Okay, I can't remember, but they're there to tell you the humidity and if it's going to rain. Uh, barometers, that's it. Puzzle box, uh, American Beach, drawer of False Street, signed. Uh, sometimes these are worth good money. Don't know. Check this phone out. Uh, Ten bucks. This is uh, brass, heavy brass. It's an old style phone. Uh, rotary dial. It's a real life phone. I don't know. You know, I pay ten. I think uh, I can get forty-five to seventy-five on it. I got two Shannon crystal uh, lead, bowl, uh, lead crystal bowls in blue. This one, it's dirty on this side, just need to clean it. Austin Production, almost done. This is an Austin Production sculpture. Sometimes the modernist ones are worth, uh, I don't know, 35 to 100 or so online. Uh, I pay 10 so who cares. I got these. These are also Austin Production. I actually snapped off. It might have been snapped off already, but... I snapped the flag off uh, while I was taking it out of the bag, which I expect to do. I'll glue it back on. I don't really care. Everything else will pay for whatever if I can't sell it because it's damaged. And it, it was a mate. One guy had a flag. One was ringing a bell. I imagine I'd get about 30 or so for those. I only paid 10. And then we got this. And this is a decanter with an African woman with rings on her neck. This is probably from the 60s or so. Um, I paid 10 for it because I thought it was pretty neat. I'm not sure what I'm going to sell it for. And that, I, that covers everything. Everything I got today. Uh, Coco Tiki. I, I lot this stuff. Um, and then it sells. And I forgot, actually, <laughs> these two watches. I got a Tommy Hilfiger watch, a Hilfiger watch for $2. And uh, this one still has the plastic on the back, so that's pretty good. And it's a fossil Mickey Mouse watch, 2 bucks. That's everything.